Hey everyone, welcome back to this brand new video uploading here on the channel of Game Time Life. In this video, I'm going to show you another top 3 male outfits using a pair of joggers. So the next one was highly requested. That was the white joggers. So today I'm going to be showcasing you 3 outfits for the male character. It's a top 3 with the white joggers. So this has been done with the creator outfit transfer glitch. If you're not familiar with this glitch, first of all check the video in the description below. I'm just only going to be showing you the components in this video, so let's get straight into it. On your second female character, you first of all want to go to the top section. For the first outfit, go to the sports jackets and buy the sea green puffer jackets, which is a merch top component. So if you want to see how the outfits look at the end, please make sure you go to the end of this video to see what each outfit is. Now you want to go over to the best cheers and put on the teal lace best cheer. This is a white fast shirt component. Now for the shoes, we're going into the boots and we're going to be purchasing the crimson cowboy boots, which are the white racing suit shoes components. For the pants, to make sure that we can merge the joggers, put on the spotted muscle pants under the sports pants section. So now once you've got that on, go over to the hat, so we're going to be putting on a plain white cap, so for that go to the forward caps and put on the grey woodland cap. So this will be just a solid plain white cap, because this first outfit will be a all white outfit with the white joggers, it looks super super cool. So for the last step we're going into accessories, go over to the gloves and put on the light woodland tactical gloves. If you got those gloves on, this is the very first outfit, you just want to go ahead and save this on slot number 2. So we can save the white joggers on slot number 1, that makes it a lot easier. So if you got your outfit saved on slot number 2, we're moving over to outfit number 2. And as you might notice, the top and the jacket and the gloves and the pants stay the same. Because um, that is basically almost the same, we're going to be grabbing a different shirt to merge on our outfit. But the components stay the same, but the outfit will be different. The only thing that we're going to be changing is we're going over to the accessories. We're going to the chains and we're going to be adding this platinum black leather necklace, which is a white scarf component. Also the shoes will change, so for that go into the sneakers and buy the pink plain high tops, which are the merging shoes components. So once you've got those uh, shoes on, you now want to go over to the head section. You want to go to the forward caps and you want to put on the dark woodland cap, which is a solid forward cap component for the blue hat. So this will be the blue and the white outfit, so if you've got these components ready, just save it on slot number 4. We can just do the white joggers on slot number 3 again, I always do this, so make sure you save outfit number 2 on slot number 4. So now for this last outfit, we will be doing something with the um, trash mat vest. So go to the top section, go to the denim jackets and buy the distressed denim jackets to so make sure that the trash vest activates. So now we're going over to the tuck t-shirt section and from here we're going to be buying the black classic, which is the trash mat vest component. So if you got this top combination on, the pants stay the same, it will be the spotted muscle pants. For shoes, we're going over to boots and we're going to be buying the black slack boots, which is the yellow Tron shoes component. So now also these gloves will stay the same, it will be the light woodland tactical gloves. And for hats, we're going back into the forward caps. And for this forward cap, we're going to be grabbing the green digital cap, which will be a orange forward cap if I am correctly. So this is like outfit number 3, we're going to be saving this outfit on um, this slot right here, on slot number 6. So on slot number 5, we can just save those white joggers again. So if you have all these outfits set, or you have the outfit set that you want to make with the white joggers, then you just want to put on the very first outfit, and if you have like one outfit, put on a standard outfit. And once you got that on, you now want to go ahead and transfer the outfits over to the male character using that creator outfit transfer glitch that I've linked through in the description. So make sure you transfer them over, then return back to the video to show you what to do next. 
So once you're back here on your meal character, now first of all you need the white joggers. Now the only way to obtain the white joggers is done with the director mode outfit glitch. Now I got these joggers really really quick using the joggers methods. I will link that video down in the description. It will show you really easy how to get those, um, you know, white joggers using that jogger method. So if you got the white joggers, you just want to remove the shirt and the shoes and you just want to save it on slot number one. Now for the very first outfit, we're going to be putting on this um, white football shirt. So that will be on the top section, go to the sports tops and on uh, number four, we have the white sports top. So um, this is for the all white outfit, the very first outfit. So if you're doing that, put this on. So if you got that white sports top on, make sure you also put on the white cotton gloves. And then before you are going to be merging, I was about to go to merge until I realized that you have to override your saved white joggers outfit. So the outfit with the white joggers that was saved on slot number one, you just want to save this outfit on top of there. And then we can just merge this together with outfit slot number one. Okay, so if you got this saved and you're doing outfit number one, you now want to make your way over to Crooked Cup. You can find it under Director Created Jobs, then you can go over to Versus and there you will see Crooked Cup. So I recommend hosting Crooked Cup. What you have to do is set team balancing over to on so the players cannot switch teams, which affects the way when it starts up. And make sure you set clothing over to player own it so we can like access or transfer it outfits. So if you got that all set, you want to hit confirm settings, just invite some players so you can start it up. So once you have started it up, you want to scroll over to own it outfit and go once to the right. Nothing should change, you should just see this on your screen. Then you want to go once to the right again and then you will see that the white fast shirt glitches through the outfits. You will see the white cap together with the gloves and the joggers. Um, you cannot see the racing suit shoes but they will also be there. So if you got your outfit set and it's looking like this, you want to hit ready to play and take this outfit inside Crooked Cup. So inside Crooked Cup you should see the race shoes up here. If you got your outfit looking like this, you want to make sure you have a earpiece unlocked or just change the gloves. So I'm just going to be putting on a earpiece, do not put on a rebreather because it will um, make sure that the head spawns off. If you do not have an earpiece, just simply change the gloves once to the right, once to the left. Just change something on the outfit suit to make sure that it saves. And if you did that, you want to pull up your phone and just simply quit Crooked Cup. Once you have quit Crooked Cup and you're back here inside um, free mode, this outfit is done. So we're going to be deleting outfit number one. Now we're just going to be saving it right underneath outfit number three. So I'm just going to call that done number one. So that one is done. We do not have to pay attention to, to that. We're now going over to outfit number two. So make sure you save this outfit underneath of your save it outfit section. So it will not get in the way. If you got it, save it there. You just now want to go back over to that white joggers outfit. Now I'm going to show you how to merge outfit number two for this white joggers. So we're going to be putting on those white joggers uh, one on slot number one. We're going back inside the top section and now we're going to be going to the hoodies. So inside the hoodies you want to scroll down and you want to put on this hoodie right here, the Aqua Camo Sleeveless Hoodie. So if you got that on, move over to the shoes section, you want to go to the Arena War Shoes. And you want to go all the way down from the Arena War Shoes and you want to buy these white and blue light ups. Now these are a little bit expensive. If you wish to choose different shoes, you can also purchase different ones. Because these shoes will actually appear on the white joggers outfit. You can also change them later on, so don't worry. But I suggest just putting it on immediately so we can merge it all together. So now if you got your hoodie and your shoes on, make sure you save the outfit on slot number one before entering Crooked Cup. And then once you have saved that, you can now go back inside Crooked Cup. You know uh, what to do. Set team balancing over to on, set clothing over to player own it, invite a player and just start it up. So once you have started it up, scroll back over to own it outfit, go once to the right, nothing should change. And go once to the right again and the white vest shirt should appear. You should see a scarf, you should see your hoodie up and a blue cap. All looking like this, this is a very rare outfit, I don't think I've ever seen this before on the male character. So that makes it very unique with that hoodie up and everything. So if you got it all set, you want to hit ready to play, take this outfit straight inside Crooked Cup. 
Inside Crooked Cup, do not put on a earpiece, just do what I am doing here in the gameplay. You just want to change the gloves. So I just went over to the glove section and I just changed the gloves to those blue surgical gloves. Just like that. So just change the gloves once, then pull up your phone and quit Crooked Cup. And back inside free mode, you can now change them back over to those white cotton gloves. You can remove outfit slot number one and save this completely merged outfit right underneath done number one as done number two. So it will not get in the way like I explained it with the previous outfits. So now you should have done number one and done number two if you're doing all these three outfits and they should be all secured and safe. So now we're going to be merging the very last outfits. So for this last outfit, we're going back into the top section, we're going into the racing jerseys, and we're going to be putting on this bumped motocross racing jersey. So if you got that racing jersey on, do not pay attention to the shoes, they will not be merged, they will be replaced for Tron shoes. So just save this outfit on slot number one, on top of that white joggers outfit, then return back over to Crooked Cup, Set team balancing to on, set player out, uh, outfits over to player own it, invite a player and go back inside the job. Now you already know what to do, scroll over to own it outfits, go once to the right, nothing should appear and go once to the right again. You should see disappear on your screen with the orange hat, the trashman vest and the white plain t-shirt on them. Also the Tron shows will be in it. So hit ready to play, take it inside Crooked Cup and inside Crooked Cup just put on a earpiece. Um, for this outfit you cannot change anything else. You can also put on some earrings. I think that will work too. I'm not sure but I recommend just putting on a earpiece. It's the most easiest way to like save this outfit. So then you already know what to do, you just simply want to pull up your phone and quit Crooked Cup. And once you are back here in free mode, you can just clean up that outfit slot number 3. And I'm just going to be saving this one on top of my outfit slot so everything is all good again. So I'm deleting this one and I'm just going to save it on slot number 4. Then I'm just going to grab done number 2 and I'm just going to be deleting this one. Just put it on and delete the slots. Then just save it on slot number 3 and do the same for outfit number 1. So you have all your outfits on top, everything is all done, the component outfits are gone and you're good to go. So these were the 3 outfits that I wanted to show you in this top 3 outfits video. I hope you guys like it, this video. Please leave a like, subscribe and turn on post notifications to get informed with the newest top 3s and more videos coming here to the channel of Ginsham Life. Bye everyone!